Seven rounds. Marv, and that is exactly very nice. He came out very sharp with the jab and nice counter shots, and uh, won the third and fourth and the first very clearly. Uh, Far Hood took round six, 10 9, and has a two point lead. 10 9 round for Broder. He just has to use him right now for sure. <laughs> oh, left hand. Seven rounds. So much bigger than Cobb's, that means. Like nervous energy right now moving around. Oh, nice shot by Cobb's. And he caught him again, and that buck to the knees, and down goes Maurice Hooker. He timed him perfect. He stepped right in front of us as he made it. Oh, and a straight, that may have been a jab that sent Hooker down. No, that was a straight left hand, that was no jab. And I see of his mother's thing. You heard Brian McIntosh tell him, hey, you may just have to fight this guy. Forget boxing, go toe to toe. Cobb is more than... There it is right there. Cops is looking for a loop. Oh, and down for a third time goes Maurice Hooker. This is what makes us fighters, you know, so you can bet the, the right hand. And once he starts throwing it to the chest and the gut, it's going to open up upstairs. The pride of Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, Malay. Combination punches on the inside. Close to him, he realized that his hands are too quick. Don't stay away from him. Get close to him and get him before the fight. Oh, oh, time, time. When he was Take brought the, the pink gloves. He's in the pink, but not this. He's one you definitely can't count out until the last bell rings. That's the Marco swinging away with the straight left hand. Only got a glancing look. Runners land. And let him throw those pop shots. Well, it looks almost like he's trying to tire Broner out by taking punches. Corner. Marco's been knocked down in his career. He was stopped. By Virgil Ortiz, he was vastly outworked. And look, you see him in trouble. There comes with a nice left hand. Open's game plan, just you know, catching counter. Right there, you should be countering. Anything that he touches. Going for you, Sergio. There's always somebody probably better than you. Oh, that, yeah, that was a left hand. Caught him on top of the head. I think that did. Great person, great human being, amazing fighter. As Claire Cobbs continues to track down Brad Solomon. And the end from Solomon, more of a slapping punch. Decent shots every round. Ooh. We haven't seen him perform in this manner. Straight left hand for Cobbs. And a straight right, and then left again. Both of these. And you're like, this is either going to be really exciting or really boring. And it seems like it's more the former than the latter at this point. Nice left hand by Cobbs right there. See, that's what he should, he should start aiming more for the body of Solomon because Solomon's pulling back. And that's it's pulling the punch line. That may be a knockdown. Let's see. No, a slip. Coming out of the nose now of Brad Solomon who answers with a left hook. This is exactly what Cobbs is looking for, those body shots. He's stabbing and taking the fight away from Solomon. Yeah, both things can be true, though. This is definitely fatigue. Look like he's in a good place. We thought it would be the case. Pressure in. And There's a counter right hand. Yeah, he has Broner in a defensive counter punch. right hand by Broner. Over three rounds. This is oh. Ralph Tother, left hand. Broner, Broner looking for the single leg. 30 seconds left in the 10th. Broner, again, the second youngest four division champion. The question is, where is he now in the scoring? We don't know. We know we think. Taking a beating in this round. Sam Burgos is thinking about it. You can tell. Okay. Uh, inside work. Broner landing serious. Broner had his man hurt again. Broner just continues to wear his man down. Oh. But, but is it? He can't. Running in. 
He's gonna get caught. Uh, Bruno, Bruno wants the knockout. He's going for it. Right hand, left hook. He's got Hutchinson hard on the ropes. Oh. Uppercut, left hook. Plenty of time left in round number two. Everything. Big right hand, big left hook. Hutchinson in trouble. Nasty. Ooh, body shot. Body he, shot. Got he got hurt. Yep. He got He's hurt. hurt again. Big Perfect. right hand. Come on. Adrian Brown. Rose is going to have to show some, some skill. Oh, yeah, he's, he got, it's, it's all cops. Focus on that body. Well, if he catches. Nice combination. By Cobb, 20 seconds. And another good combo. Oh, oh. wow. Cobb, one after another. And now Bill Lobos in big time trouble. Will he go down? Yeah, Cobb has got to be, he's got to be careful. The kind of conditions that they must be. The fight would have been. told his fighter, you need to win both rounds. Oh, great combination there by Blair Cobb. And it's now, not shots letting Cops. the hands go. Oh! And Vila Lobos moved up to punch with authority. Cobbs is starting to move in for the kill. And oh, oh, uppercut! Big wow. uppercut! Oh, wow! And this one is over just like that! Oh, my goodness. Look at this guy. This guy, Cobbs. a performance and what a knockout. Vision. Oh. And to be able to come in and try and dominate an opponent, which Broner gets active now, and Theophane bent over momentarily. It's happening now more regularly than I've ever seen it. Oh, and a nice shot with a right hand by Broner. He thinks he's got something here. He throws a flurry to try and get him out of there in round number three. And another right hand lands. Theophane can't see it, can't stop it, and Broner goes for the kill. And that's it. It's over. A lot of, it turns a lot of people off, but when when he oh, oh there's that wow, counter. And even while he took the walk, stop and throw the cut. Yeah. Winding up with the right uppercut, lands the jab. Broner, the pace, the crowd, Bill Smith. Right hand lands for Broner. And they exchange here with Broner of Adrian, the problem bro for Bent organization. Adrian Broner to close the show in front of his hometown oh, crowd. Shot. Good body shot in hand. Left hook, right uppercut. Broner, that's enough. The referee, Harvey. And Kyle Fox on the 6th of July in Los Angeles went the distance with a flare. The flare, Cobb. It's when you get tested, we can find out who they are. Well, coming out of the gate here, he's been very, very... Get the sense, though, he wants to make a bit of a statement yeah, tonight. He, does. he is facing a naturally smaller guy. Has been stopped four times, so he does have a track. You want to throw in a fight where they're going to look really, really good, and they start to psychologically gain a little bit of... Okay, super aggressive. Bit wild is Cobb. Lunge and he drops the Valadez. Warm from Blair Cobbs. Breathing deep is Valadez. Blood all over his face now. All red. Now the body shots. Going back on the ropes. He's all off balance. And Blair Cobbs just pushing back Valadez. A lot of heart from the Mexican Valadez. But Blair Cobbs is trying to finish it here in the second. Jay Nady starting to look in. And he waves it off. A second round stoppage for Blair Cobbs. Valadez. Hard 
shots like that will. There's a perfect catch. Escobedo is trying to defend, and he's not a bad defensive fighter. That exchange is just that, it's just that now he's been a little bit... Good left hook by Bruno. Or along the ropes. And that vicious body shots and picking off. Escobedo trying to hang on. The corner trying to stop it. And to make 130 pounds. No, no, estaba hablando de, del limpiecito, lo clavó ahí Mikey García. Considerar que los jueces están en lados opuestos sería Bronner. Así es, y, y a, 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 aquí se tiene que comenzar a apretar. El... Bueno, y consistente ha sido entonces del californiano sobre... Eso santo para Mikey es que García. Tiene que ser, mencionabas tú en la historia sí. de la victoria, Raúl, tiene que sí. ser más físico. He's daring, he's very daring, we know he's charismatic. But sometimes, being like that, getting caught because his chin is up in the air, jabs and slowing down the pace. That's what I would want from Cobbs. Left hand is blocked by Cobbs. Ortiz goes back and put Cobbs down. His glove touched the canvas. That's a knockdown. Cobbs is knocked down in the first round. He's hurt, Brian. He's our jab there by Ortiz. Cuffing left hand there by Cobbs. See that check right hook right there. That's, good. That's what's going to keep Ortiz on, in check. Ortiz keeps coming at him, but he's boxing. Yeah, you wonder the effect of that knockdown and feeling that kind of power. Did it slow Blair Cobbs down a little bit? But here you see wow. him right back to the body. That is beautiful combination. Did until he threw a beautiful multi-punch combination there in round five in the middle of that round. Oh, and down goes Ortiz. Wow, one shot. As he should because Carlos Ortiz is punching in between the shots, looking to catch the more aggressive Cobbs coming in. Good left hand there by Cobbs. Yeah, but Ortiz is not a sitting duck. He is able to fire back and fire back. Absolutely so. That's what he's aiming for. Cobbs tries his own overhand left. Oh, and a hard hook. Good shot from the right side. That hurt Ortiz. Ortiz is hurt. You see his, his feet are not under him. Over the top. Now he's trying a few things a little different. Through the blinder. Oh. A dead box. Well, he said he can't box, so this fight's over. Big shots. Broner's had a better effect. Perez hurt on a right to the ear. Perez is standing right in front of him for three rounds. Three and up to 30 to 27. Adrian Broner. I mean, he's landing the hardest shot. Good straight right hand and down goes Perez. Not going to make it. He is as explosive and confident. Can he keep that chin tough? specializes in volume punching. Volume punching short, tight shots. Cobb swinging for the... Back on his jab, now talking to Cobb. Big left hand connects from Cobb. That's the best shot of the fight from him. That was a big, well-timed shot by Cobb right there. But you gotta give Rocha credit. He took that well. With that left hand. Jabs his body straight left up top. Rocha setting up that big left hand, upset. Champion, Blair, what Blair Cobb. There's a left hook. There's a right hand. Oh. Broner having. Here's the left hook. 
Adrian, the problem. Adrian Broner. Bro.